Hey, what's up, guys? This is Jason with SoundDesignStudio.net. Uh, go ahead and hit that subscribe button for me before we get too deep into the video before you forget. But uh, today we're going to hit a, a video on the X32 console. Uh, this is going to be about the new update, uh, the 4. Point, I think it's 4.0.2. Uh, let me make sure that that's the right, um, right one I'm telling you before, before we get too much further. I don't want to sit there and give you the wrong version and then, and then it's not. So yeah, this is. Yeah, I think it's 4.0.2. So in this version, uh, you're able to change your 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 startup screen and also um, so you can put your logo or whatever on the startup and also um, change your your lock screen. So. Um, what I'm going to do, I'm going to show you how to do so. So I'm going to, so it's fairly simple. Um, but the way I d did it, it's on, I had to do, I had to do it through Photoshop, but I'm pretty sure you can do, let me turn my screen around. Can't be any larger than seven ninety nine, seven hundred and ninety nine by three hundred and ninety nine. But we're gonna do. I'm gonna do three fifty six. No, let's do three ninety nine pixels. All right. And let's say okay. All right, so now we have that size down. Now what we want to do is we want to go up here to where it says image. We want to switch the image to indexed color. All right, after we switch that, we want to leave all that the same, 256. Click OK. Now, what you can do is you can sit there and hit Save As. And save it to whatever location you're going to, your, your, um, your, your thumb drive, your flash drive. And you have to save it as... A BMP file. All right. So you have to save it as a BMP file. And the file name has to be custom boot.bmp. All right. So after you have it saved as custom boot.bmp, hit save. And you should be ready to go for the next step, which is putting it in the console and starting it up. All right, guys, so we're right here next to the, the uh, X32 Compact. We're for the startup, the X32. Well, first thing you wanna do is, you wanna go to your X32, make sure that you do the update first. go into your settings and then go um, right here where it says custom boot hit create hit create and that's going to put a file to your flash drive 
it's gonna put it on your little flash drive and but you have to have your flash drive in there of course for it to put it on there so after that's on there and you have your file that you made on Photoshop or whatever your BMP file that's the right specs and you've created that file now when you start up your console this is what should happen your logo should pop up pop up all right so and it's gonna pop up and say load custom boot state uh, custom boot state from USB and you're just gonna hit confirm every time so all right so that's how you um, you do your custom logo every time you start up your console and a bad thing about it guys you have to have your USB stick in for it to work you cannot save it to the console sorry but you can't so all right appreciate you for watching thanks